on this peaceful island crowned by the great volcano Mount Minoka occurred the mightiest eruption that ever shook the earth, burying the beautiful city beneath it in molten lava and creating destructive tidal waves that raced around the world. For 300 years, this mighty volcano lay dormant. A new and more beautiful city sprang up at its base. But now, after centuries of inactivity, slight tremors are being felt. At the Bureau of Meteorology, a group of scientists watchfully check delicate instruments to determine the seriousness of this renewed activity. and I want you to send me some real stories. Now here are your steamship tickets and here are your press passes. You'll need those to get down there. Goodbye, good luck, and for Pete's sake, see if you two can work together for a change. Right, Chief. So long. That's funny. Say, Lois, you have my press pass. What makes you think I've got it? Sorry, sir, but you have to get one down to headquarters. Thanks. Uh, you go on ahead, Lois, and I'll join you later. Now, what did I do with that? Poor Clark. Too bad he lost his pass. <laughs> From all indications, we expect things to start popping any time. In order to save the city, we decide to blast the higher end of the crater, thereby diverting the flow of lava away from the city and into the ocean below. Is the chief in? I would like to see him about a press pass. He'll be back shortly. Would you have a seat? Thanks.
How's the story coming, Lois? Oh, fine, Clark. Too bad you weren't in on it. Maybe I would have been. If I hadn't lost my past.